Hi, just a quick lab video. I wanted to show you something that I found on eBay. I was listing, uh, I actually set up a new eBay store just to list my multimeter the other day and I haven't used eBay in a while. I haven't searched for test gear and stuff like that because normally I like I search for uh, gear to tear down or gear to repair or uh, something like that. I haven't used it in a while and it seems to have not only have all changed uh, eBay Australia anyway, uh, which is what I'm talking about here. If it is applicable to eBay uh, US and other uh, countries, then please let me no, but um, eBay Australia seems to have all changed all the categories, but not only that, it seems to be like broken. Half the stuff does not work, half the categories, and let me show you what I'm talking about. Normally, if you want to uh, search, you know, you can just search for something, which is fine, but I'm not uh, too worried about that today. What I'm worried about is the categories. Now, uh, so you go shop by category, you go down here. Now this is eBay Australia. I know it's different for different countries. US in particular has more categories for uh, test gear and things like that. But you go down to electrical here, okay? And these are all the existing, these are all the categories, okay? And these categories have been here for like a decade. They've been here since, you know, eBay first started, okay? These are the categories that I'm used to seeing on eBay Australia. So if I want to go in and search for multimeters, for example, I would choose meters. So I go in here, so it's, so the, um, uh, the category listing is industrial electrical meters fine nothing's changed okay except that they do have changed the layout to this we you know this wanky shopping cart uh thing which i don't like but normally you hit this refine results button which used to be over here but you hit this and usually it'll show you like the usual detailed list okay instead of this stupid shopping cart wah, 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 wah. fail if i could find my fail button i'd hit the damn thing maybe i'll just go <coughs> like that Ooh, sorry for those um using headphones that's going to leave a pattern on my forehead. Anyway, um, let's have a look. Look, there's nothing here. It is broken, right? There is nothing in industrial electrical meters. It's ridiculous. But if we go back here, okay, and it, power supplies is the same, signal generators are the, is the same, I believe. But if we go into oscilloscopes, it will actually work, okay? Oscilloscopes, industrial electrical oscilloscopes, refine results, we're in. Look, we're, it's displaying oscilloscopes, okay? So that all looks fine and dandy, okay? But watch this, right? You click on an oscilloscope, okay? This is um, from a local seller here in uh, Sydney, right? And But look, all the categories have changed. Look up the top here. It's got industrial, electrical and test equipment, test measurement and inspection, analyzers and data acquisition, oscilloscopes and vectorscopes. It's like they've got two entirely separate categories of categories, like two entirely section, like displayed categories. It, it's ridiculous, okay? And if we hit oscilloscopes and vectorscopes, for example, then, okay, it goes down and shows them. But let's go back here, okay? Let's go industrial electrical, okay? And we're back to the old category. Look, we're back to the old category here, okay? And show all, and look, the industrial, all these have changed again, okay? So let's go back even further. Let's go back all the way, right? And let's, here we go, right? Meters, okay? Let's go into meters and, oh, there, sorry, there's nothing. <sighs> so retarded, really. They've let the work experience kids loose. Anyway, electrical and test equipment. Hang on. No, I, I, I want to go all the way back. I want to go all the way back. I want to show you this, okay? I will go to industrial, electrical, meters, okay? And from this product page, okay, I can choose, say, this um, UniT uh, clamp meter here, okay? So I can open that. I'll open that in another tab. You saw before that refined results did not work. It gave me no things whatsoever. Okay, so we're in industrial electrical meters. If we open up that product, bingo, we instantly appear in industrial, electrical and test equipment, test measurement and inspection, test meters and detectors, electric circuit and multimeters, and multimeters. Like it, it, It's it, like gone through to that category. Okay, and once again, if we click on this multimeters thing, I'm used to doing this. I do this all the time when I'm searching eBay stuff. I'll like, oh, okay, I'll go back a category and search. So I go into multimeters and there's nothing. There's nothing there. 
what the hell is going on? They've completely broken the category system in eBay Australia. It's ridiculous. Anyway, uh, I've um, listed my new Bryman uh, multimeter, for example, and it forced me to use all these new categories when I listed it. I couldn't just go electrical, industrial electrical meters. Couldn't that I've been doing for like a decade. Couldn't do that. Um, I have to now put it into these, you know, one, two, three, four, five, six nested uh, things before I can get in there. And once again, if I hit other, if people find this, okay, they search for my meter, just like I did here, and they go, oh, okay, yeah, I, know, I don't want to buy this one. I want to go into multimeters. There's nothing there. Yet it'll work for some categories. It Will electric circuits and multimeters work? I'm not sure. Nope. Nothing in the higher level category. Nothing. Like a test meters and detectors. Will we eventually get there? Yay! We eventually get there. And then we got all these uh, weird categories which have never shown up on eBay Australia before. <sighs> they've let the work experience kids loose on the code again. Unbelievable. And they've broken. Broken. Like uh, all the categories and stuff. Anyway, it, it's just ridiculous. Search uh, still seems to work okay. But the category browsing system, broken. Uh, so if it's... But I've only checked eBay Australia. I don't know other eBay US and eBay UK and the other uh, countries. If they're broken or have changed recently too, leave it down in the comments. I'd love to know um, whether or not this is an isolated thing to eBay Australia or not, or they're in some process. If you know they're in some process of changing categories and merging them with, say, the US ones or something, because as I said, the US always has had in the test gear category a lot more categories available than we've had on eBay Australia. And it was kind of like a weird cross mix between them, but it always worked. Those categories, when you clicked on these categories up the top, they always worked. And all of a sudden, they have to look I, like I just went a category down the side. These categories down the side have always worked. Uh, frequency, some of them work. For example, um, oscilloscopes still works. If I could find the damn thing, what's it under now? Sorry, I forget. Anyway, I, like a, a few of them still work, but. Meters, for example, and frequency counters and power supplies and uh, things like that, uh, signal generators, does not work. It's crazy. So, I don't know. There, there, could, be a, there could be a good, uh, there could be a silver lining to this. It, it could mean that um, you might be able to pick up a few more bargains now on eBay because if people are searching via categories and it's all screwing up and not working properly, then there could be less competition uh, to get test gear and things like that because test gear in Australia is actually quite hard to get. I usually have to do mostly overseas um, uh, ones. Like I would search, for example, if I'm in uh, multi, if I'm in test gear down here, I would have to actually go into a specific category down here. Let's go into the clamp meter. Let's go into the test meters and detectors, which actually lists us something. Go down here. I would, if I'm searching for stuff, I would choose worldwide, for example. So this finds only the suppliers that will ship to Australia. Um, so, and then I can go into, say, if I'm searching for something for a repair video or something, I would go for search for parts non-working. And that sort of still seems to, uh, you know, still seems to do the business. So it looks like it's still okay from that aspect, but categories seems just completely retarded. Something has seriously gone wrong and broke in eBay Australia. So anyway, hopeless. So if you know what's going on, leave it in the comments down below. Catch you next time.